Yeah. And from the 50, we took some stories that I asked these actors to tell in front of you on the stage. Okay, another couple things for the parents is, or other people here, is that we tried to, we are now going to interface a lot of the digital stuff with the live action. We not only feel that this is the future, this is the present. So with my uh, coder team, mostly Ryan Walsh right here, give it a hand for that. We hope we're the first in the world to do a number of things. Ryan has helped me trick up two, three connects. Now these connects, he coded them so they become live VJs. My students know this, the, that on one side of the body is one half of a film loaded up. The other side is another film loaded up. We don't know how this at all works. This piece already has two more lives. It's in Soho this Monday with a couple of these actors. And it's probably at Galapagos in June. So come and see that. We'll keep everyone up on that. Uh, in addition, my other students prepared the film and, the, and uh, the ambient track and some of the music for this piece, uh, which is the Decameron by Boccaccio, who wrote this piece about love in the time of the plague 500 years ago. Pretty cool. OK. Got all these collaborators. The last thing, I want Ryan to stand right up here, which is pretty trippy and science fiction-y. And I hope to I hope to expand this. Listen up, actors. This is the trippiest. Ryan finishes late last night. Ryan is actually moving a motor with his brain. He has a brain sensor cap on now. Give that servo a little move. There it is. this stuff that he coded this last night. In the future, this means we could move and open stages with the mind. With the audience mind, you guys, in the future, could all have these caps on. Deciding where you want actors to go, opening stage, starting your car, doing all sorts of weird things. So I want you to wrap your heads around that philosophically. This is a big experiment. These guys did great to bring it all together. But this is the trippiest, most science fiction thing on the top of it all. Uh, thanks to Sid for suggesting we get the cap. Chris got the cap. He put the cap on Ryan. And we hope to take this abroad to uh, other venues to, to integrate. If anyone wants to help us integrate this with film, to move, to move sound with your brain waves is trippy. It's really a, an amazing century that this stuff we're getting into now. So everyone did good. One round of hand for all the. <laughs>